Oh. Oh, my head. Oh. I'm back. Any hand. Caden, I need to help them. Hello and welcome to Online's Doom Light Attack playing The Sims 4. I figured as The Sims 4 is one of those games that I really like playing, that I'll give it a go on the YouTube um, channel. And uh, see that I've not played on the channel before. So yeah, I'm thinking for this, uh, like, go through the sims i'm gonna play with just the one sim maybe usually i do like maybe two or three or like one with a dog but i want to try going with like just the singular sim so yeah let's uh, pop into new game shall we right huh. that's an interesting looking uh sim hmm. right uh jago darkstar huh interesting weird that i can't edit some things as well Let's see what kind of is he a self-assured perfectionist and a genius <laughs> fair enough right uh well i'm liking the clothes although i feel like it's a bit like like dark i mean you have dark stone in your name i guess why don't we uh change up your outfits a little bit how many outfits do you have you have one of each yeah let's uh let's go spruce up jago darkstar here here we go, giving him a nice spruce up. All nicely coloured now. Here's his everyday outfit. His smart outfit. Fitness. Sleep, just his undies. Party. I like this one. I think this is a nice little look on him. Uh, it's the same, yep. Uh, <laughs> just going bare, bare chested for his uh, hot weather one. And nice and snug on his cold weather one. Yeah, liking that look. There we go, so let's go in and uh, make a house for our sim, Jago Darkstar here. So we don't need anything too big, because it's just him. It's one of these small plots here. We'll probably do. Uh, we could go like really small up here. I think this one should be fine. Yeah, only costs 2,000 to get him to move into this spot. Cool, let's go, let's make his house. And I think that is a good spot for the uh, the first episode, getting the sim and the house done. <laughs> On your phone already, eh? <laughs> right, so I think they added new, some new features since uh, I've played. Like, I think you have all kinds of... Um, Work. Go to work, what? You have a job already? Breakthroughs. Huh. That's weird. Okay, well, uh... You go to work then. He's an inventor. Weird. Don't, didn't think it seems you had jobs when you started off. Huh. Okay, um... Right, I don't know if you can... Uh, maybe it's not in the game yet, but I think they added a bunch of like new mechanics for your sims, like personality. But uh, maybe... Oh, this menu looks new. Interesting. Okay, well, I'm sure I'll come across the new uh, mechanics if there are they are in the game yet uh, later on. For now, though, we need to focus on making the uh, the house which also be very uh, fun to do while it's snowing right so let's head to build mode and I know how to play Emily go away Emily it ain't my first rodeo it is on the channel but not my first rodeo right so let's have a look at the area so this is yes yeah, someone else's plot so this is our main uh, like walkway so we want the front of the house to be here let's move you first of all just a uh, mailbox uh, I'm not sure where the front of the house is going to be so let's pull it here and work around that uh, so I could go and like be like cheaty and place the preset rooms but now I'm going to do it myself uh, walls 
yeah we'll talk there we go um usually i try to go like really big and cover up the whole area but i feel like we should probably make it like a small thing just to accommodate for the one sim and have it everything like close for him i guess like you know like a first house sort of deal so things like the living room and the kitchen like join up etc so let's see So again, it's only the one sim that I've got living here, so we don't need anything too big. And obviously we can't spend too much money. Because we'll need to have enough for the uh, main appliances. There you go, we'll just do a nice, simple just box shape for now. Uh, let's see. So if we have the main door, we have like the front door there. It's coming here. Uh, let's see, we're coming to the living room area, I guess. We could have like living room here and maybe kitchen like join up to it there. Then we could have like, the bedroom and bathroom up there. That should be all we need for our first house. So, I guess, let's see, we don't really need too big of a bedroom and a like bathroom. So let's put it there. And make the bathroom smaller. There you go, you have like a wide bedroom. And yeah, we'll make this like both living room and kitchen. How do you do half walls? I can never remember what the half wall button is. Uh, I guess we don't necessarily need to do half walls. We could just make like countertops here, I guess. Yeah, we'll do count the tops, I think. Okay, so that's the base room layout. Nothing impressive, I know, but it's his first house, so uh, make do. Uh, doors. Ah, oh, little <laughs> chalk monster friend on this door. Uh, no, we just want a, a standard old door. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's go for this one. And we'll have some nice doors inside or nicer maybe well the white doors inside uh let's have your bedroom door go there and there you go i could add an extra door to go straight into the bathroom i guess but it's not that much more of an extra walk to go straight to there so that's fine uh right okay so door's done Windows. Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's do these little, like, smallish windows here. Uh, yeah, I think there. Uh, we should really have like a yeah one of these sort of ones for the bathroom have them like high up got people spying on you in the bathroom uh, there and there and add a few more on this wall yeah we I mean, could always get rid of them if there's uh, their stuff blocking them I guess Right, windows done. Uh, let's do the actual like wall paint. Uh, no, I just want paint. Uh, we'll have the outside be nice red. Uh, where's the like the wall like paint wall button? Uh, by room, that's it. Bam. Bam. And one more. Bam. Yeah, there we go. Outside wall done. Now then, let's do inside. What do we want the living room slash kitchen to be? I guess we probably also want it to be two separate colours, maybe. Yeah, this, we'll do this one for the kitchen. 
So if we say the kitchen goes up to sort of like here. Let me get the balls up. Yep, there you go. That's good. Got it. Okay. And then we'll do... Purple. Uh, yeah, let's go crazy. Let's go purple for the living room. Awesome. Now then, we need a blue for the uh, bathroom. Let's get all room. There we go. Now, for your bedroom, you've got the main theme, like color scheme I got for him was like an orange. So we should do an orange color, really. Uh, where is it? Is there an orange? Not really an orange. Maybe in this one. Hey, there we go. Orange. Nice. Okay. All painted now, we just need to get the floors going. Uh, where's the floor one? That's the floor one. Uh, let's see. Uh, carpet. Uh, yeah, darkish colour here. Oh, it's the line. Cool. I guess probably also want carpet for the bedroom. Uh, let's do red, maybe? Yeah, let's do a red carpet floor for the bedroom. Why not? Uh, we'll need like lino or tile or something for the bathroom. I always like this one. Although, this is very bathroom. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Uh, kitchen. There you go, keeping that yellow theme for the kitchen. Nice. Okay, all the small little detail bits out of the way. Now we can actually start decorating and putting stuff inside the house, I think. Unless I'm missing something obvious. Don't think I am. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's start with. Well, let's get the important stuff out of the way first. Let's start with like the kitchen. Uh, objects by room. Oh, and kitchen's the first one here. Good. Right, okay. First thing you need, obviously, is the fridge. Stop telling me I'm offline, game. I know I'm offline. Uh, let's see. What is the cheapest one you can get that isn't just like crap food? I guess this one here, the Crispinox adequate. Yeah, because the price goes up quite a bit after that. Uh, we'll put you... Yeah, I'll put you against that bit there. Uh, let's get the counters going. Uh, I think blue counters probably look nice with the yellow. Uh, actually, before I do that, let me put in the stove. Man, you don't have much choice. It goes either like not quite good quality to, yikes, more expensive for a little bit more quality. Oh, I guess we're dishing out a bit of money. It is important after all. Uh, let's put it... Put it there. Yeah. And now let's put some counters in, because we know we're working around. Uh... We'll just... Uh... Oh, it's trying to... 
through some weird auto counter shenanigans with this. Uh, hang on, I might need to move that over. That's fair, okay. Not like how that window's now a bit off. There we go. Okay, and so I also now want to. Hmm. It's weird that it's doing that, like a little like lip. Oh, that's really annoying. Don't like that one bit. Hmm. What if I get rid of that for a second? Uh, so uh, is there anything else I could put there that would work? No, I think it has to be these sort of counters. Why is it doing that? I think it's because it's against the wall, maybe. It's doing that. Can I do anything to fix that, though? Probably not. If I go like that. I mean, it's weird. Like, it's just like a gap there, but if I then do... Yeah, then I can sort of like continue on and it's fine. Just have to like do something with this gap here. I might also... Uh... Like a little bit of the lino there is picking out. I don't like that. Uh, we need to make, do something with that. That's that's bugging me though. We could probably make that like the rubbish area. Uh, so like just a big like hefty bin that can go in there. Oh, that's that side bin. Uh, uh, oh no, that's an outdoor bin as well. Uh, anything kitchen-y that I could put in there that would make sense. Or maybe a giant plant. That could work. Ah, a bit too small. Oh, too big. I think we put that there. It would just be like a weird design choice by the person who designed the uh, the kitchen. Not, not me. <laughs> right, okay, so now we've got that, the idea is that I can now put one of these stools down. Uh, yeah, like these stools. Oh, is it not? Oh, I thought you could latch these on to... Maybe it has to be from like the other side. Ah, oh, well that throws my whole reasoning for doing this out the window. Alright, well that's fine. Just get rid of this then. Saves the awkward looking thing going on. Uh, yeah, sorry plant. Copy that, put that back, and then, boop, boop. Uh, yeah, then I guess we could put a small, uh, like, dining table, uh, 
situation in the middle here then. We only need like small because it is just uh Jago that's here. Uh where's all the doubles? Ah, there you go, there's a double. Uh, yeah, put it there, that way he has space for his uh, cooking over that side. Uh, what's some basic key looking chairs? Oh yeah, that's pretty basic. I guess in case you do get company, you can have the second chair there as well. Right, okay, let's go back to kitchen now. Uh, we need a sink. This little round one. Uh, we'll put it... Uh... Yeah, we'll put it on this side. Put like that window needs to like be here now. <laughs> Just so it sort of fits. And what else have we got? Oh yeah, we need the uh the bin. Uh Yeah, I guess bin can go there. I uh, don't necessarily need a microwave. Do we want a fire alarm though? That right there. I don't think it matters where the fire alarm is, as long as it's in like, the same room, I think it goes off. Uh, oh, lights, that's the thing I uh, haven't done. Uh, I need like ceiling lights. There you go, ceiling lights. Uh, I don't want anything too like big. Oh god, yeah, here's the, like the really bright ones. <laughs> cool, that works. I could do like one a room then. Uh, yeah, there. Cool, nicely uh, illuminated. Uh, let's see. Right, well that's all the essentials for the kitchen for now, so let's start with the bathroom. Right, definitely need a toilet. No, not potties, toilet, there we go. Oh, don't want an uncomfortable one. Yeah, let's get the cheapest one that's not uncomfortable. Uh, go there. Uh, we'll give him... I'm sure we can splash out for a tub. Yeah, let's go basic tub. Put you there. Get a sink. And put you there by the toilet. Oh, mirror as well. Yep, can't get the mirror. Boom. And I'll actually put a rug in here as well. Part of Essentials, Happy Toes map. There we go. Nice. Okay, essentials for the bathroom, sorted. Uh, essentials for the bedroom. Bed, obviously. Ooh, uncomfortable, uncomfortable. Discomfort relief, there we go, we want that sort of one. This bed looks very, like, thin. <laughs> Is that just me? I think it's just me imagining it, maybe. Uh, right, let's have your bed. Put it there. And we'll give you this fancy looking wardrobe here. Uh, do like an orange color. I 
kind of annoying that it's not going like right back against the wall. Oof, that's <laughs> strangely annoying. But whatever. So we'll go there. So I want to change the colour of the bed. Hmm. We'll go for green, why not? Uh, mirror? Let's, yeah, let's put a mirror in here. Put that in this corner over here. Oh, that sticks out like a lot. We'll put you there then. Uh, yeah, end table. Uh, that's a little too basic. There you go. Does that come in any other colours? Ah, orange, there we go. Uh, right, that's the basics. We can put other things in there later. Now, living room. Uh, let's get a stand going for a TV. Where do we want the TV? Guess against this wall here. Yeah, put it there. And I think we'll go... Oh, it's quite small. I guess we could dish out for the TV, maybe. We could have got quite a bit of money still left over. Yeah, we'll, we'll splurge on the TV. That'll be like the most expensive thing in the house going. And let's see. Don't need a big chair. Oh, orange chair. Nice. Oh. Also, I feel like we need something in the middle, though. Oh, does this come in orange? It doesn't. Oh, this does, though. Nice. I feel like this needs to be orange now. Uh, I can make it, like, wooden. Uh, we don't necessarily need a radio yet. Right, okay, I think that's all the essentials done. So we could dish out a little bit on decoration-based things. So let's see, let's get some plants in. There was that big plant, there we go. This bad boy can, uh go in the corner there. Just the, the weird plant. Uh, yeah, let's put some like succulents in there. Uh, any little like... Ah, little tiny ones, there we go. Put that there by the sink. Oh, let's put this in here, there we go. And ah, uh, pop it on the top of the shelf. That's fine. We'll put that there. Uh, let's see anything else? Let's go by uh, the decorations. More decorations, yeah. They've got all the like the seasonal Christmas stuffs here. Let's put a pride flag up somewhere. Put it up there above the TV. Or it's kind of hidden by a TV. There we go. Up above the TV. Nice. Anything else in particular? 
wall mounted coat rack I mean he only has like the one outfit type really so this is kind of just like a gimmick but sure let's put that there what colors does that come in do I have one that's like mostly orangey sort of clothes maybe not really we'll stick with that one then I think for now Right, uh, anything in here maybe for the kitchen? Ah, there we go. Pots and pans. Uh, yeah, let's put them there next to the cooker. I think there's like a spice rack one as well, isn't there? There's the spice rack. Unless I've passed it already. Oh, actually, this is a war ornament site now. I need, like, a uh, clutter, I guess it might fall under. Yeah, I think it'd be here somewhere. It's body care essentials. Uh... Oh, umbrella stand. Uh, don't like that it sticks out like so far into the room. I'll put that there though. Uh, spices though, I was looking for spices. Where are you hiding? I know you're around here somewhere, spices. Oh, yeah, that's a little spice rack. Not the one I was looking for, but that'll do. Put you there. Oh, and the uh, knife block set. Uh, yeah. Ah, there we go. Put you right there. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, right. I think we need some, like, posters or something for the fill out some of the other bits though uh... mm, a bit big oh here we go is this in wooden frame? Ah, there we go. Sure, I'll put that there. And... Put this one of the flowers up here. Uh, what about the bedroom? Some of this stuff's getting quite expensive. I might hold out, I think, for the rest of it. Got like a really good start going here. But I am going to save some in case something like pops up and I need to spend the money on that so I think I think this is the house done for now I think yeah let's go into live mode and uh, oh yeah Jago is that his uh, job that he apparently has weird and uh, yeah I'm going to leave this episode here and then the next episode we'll actually start with our uh, live mode gameplay so uh, yeah i hope you enjoyed this uh, first episode of the sims 4 if you did have a like and a comment if you already want to slap subscribe button it's totally free and helps the channel grow thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video have a nice day